Hello everyone, welcome to 3dedesignacademy.com. In this lesson, we will learn about the Freeform Blend tool. Now the Freeform Blend tool is a surface creation tool that is used to connect two different surfaces. Okay. So it is kind of like the, even though it's supposed to connect the two surfaces, the usage in, when you're actually using alias in a worker environment or modeling environment, it is sort of used as a replacement for either the surface fillet or also the skin tool. So let me show you some examples. Okay, so in order to you, so it's the tool is located on the surfaces and there's a freeform blend tool right there. So double click and you'll see that the options are a little bit similar to how the, um, the surface fillet is set up. So uh, the most, let's just connect these two surfaces like this and you just, just say build and you have a surface like that. So it can you can also use to uh, connect two different surfaces in uh, different locations. So if I just wanna uh, connect this to this, you can do that too. And you'll see the, all the very smooth transition between the two. Now, like the Surface Fillet tool, you can also inc uh, adjust the continuity. So let's say uh, you don't like the smoothness of this and you want to make it a little bit smoother, you can also change it to G2 curvature and you'll see that the continuity is a little bit smoother. So right now you can also see the edge right here where the transition is happening. So let's say you want to change it to G2 curvature. You'll see that the blend is a little bit smoother like that. Okay, um, so it, this also has a, a several set of uh, continuity options. Oh, actually, before we do that, let's... Um, so, um, because of this, uh, even though this uh, tool can replace a surface fillet, it can also replace the skin tool. And if you use the G0 position, you're able to just connect the surfaces like this, just a plan, uh, the flat plane to connect the two. So even in here, you can use G0 position on both sides like this. So, oh, also because of this has, you are able to control both sides. Let's say you want to have smooth transition from here, but a positional transition right here. So if I just, so, so this is side two. So let's say I want to change this to G2 and you can create something like this. So same thing over here. If you just want one side one to have a curvature continuity, you can do something like that. Okay, so also like the fill, uh, surface fillet tool, you can uh, you have some several continuity uh, as a flow control. So you can either change the connect ends. Right now, because it was at edge line, you have a very nice transition between the two surfaces. If you change it to connect ends, you'll see something like this. You can change the default like that, or you can, yep, that's it, edge line. For most of the time, you're gonna, we are probably going to be going with uh, edge line. And, also here, you can use connect ends or you can use default. You'll notice that it's 90 degrees over here and also 90 degrees over here between these two edges. Okay, so that's a freeform blend tool. And that concludes this lesson and thank you guys for watching.